Courtroom drama returns to CBS2 this fall. Season 10 of Hot Bench premieres on Monday, September 11th. Here's a preview. We know what you both are claiming. Somebody has to be lying. That's a serious allegation. Either you're telling me the truth or you're not. Okay, that makes no sense to me. Ma'am, you're lying. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. You're really insulting my intelligence right now. Stop. You honor, I swear, look at my eyes. Everything I'm telling is the honest to God truth. You guys have a lie detector? We're the lie detector. Hot bench. Joining me now are judges Michael Corriero, Rachel Juarez, and Yodit Tewoldi. Thank you all for being here. Good morning. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning. I feel like I'm in front of court. It's kind of scary. <laughs> How excited is everyone about this new season? We've got a lot of exciting cases coming up, and we kick off on Monday with a gentleman who was sitting in his car with his leg kind of hanging out the door, getting into his car, when a woman came up and hit him, seriously injuring his leg. But truth is stranger than fiction, you know, because of course these are all real cases. And the woman pulled over, and the drama really started there. And we've got some compelling video footage of the fight that ensued. Oh. And a pretty interesting legal twist at the end as well. Oh, my goodness. Any other cases that, that kind of stood out to you this season? Well, well good morning, Cindy. First, good morning. First of all, I, I'm a son of New York, and I'm very excited. We're very excited about being back on, on Channel 2. You know, uh, it, it's uh, been a while, and, and uh, we, we enjoy the, the opportunity and appreciate CBS's strong support of us in this regard so we're back and not only are we back we're back with some really some fascinating cases and some interesting exchanges you, i think your clips show us at our fiercest we're really not we're really very <laughs> gentle yeah. and kind but we have some very very bizarre cases that we have to resolve and wednesday for example we have we have a case involving a a patron of a a, a gymnasium uh, who accused the owner of the gymnasium of slandering her, slandering her and libeling her in terms of her relationship with the trainer. Oh. And we got into it and it revealed some rather bizarre business relationships. Tune in on Wednesday and you'll see the answer to, to the, sol the solution to that particular problem. And Judge Corriero, you know, you talked about being a, a son of New York. You've been with the show for seven seasons. You're so well known here in New York for your work helping Sorry. young offenders get back on the right path. Tell us about a little bit about that work. Well, I'm, I'm still involved. You know, I, when I come back to New York, uh, we, we created the... Uh, Families Rising program, which is an alternative to incarceration program that not only deals with the kid who is in trouble, but his entire family, because we think it is a family problem very often uh, that, that propels a young person to violate the law or do something uh, that gets them into a lot of trouble. So I'm very excited about that. That keeps me going. So when I come back, uh, I, I, I'm looking for a diversion. And, uh, and I'm really so happy to be with my, my two colleagues who, who keep me young, as I said. <laughs> just shortly well, let's talk to them, Judge Juarez and Judge Tewaldi. This is your second season on the show. What is it like to come back? Oh my God, I couldn't wait to come back. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, these cases just keep us on our toes. I mean, it, it's fun. It, it allows us to really bring in our experiences as attorneys into the courtroom, um, be transparent with our viewers, teach them a little something while also being entertaining. And there's, there's three of you making these decisions. What's it like to deliberate amongst each other? It's one of my favorite parts, yeah. it, and it's one of the things that we love so much about doing this because, you know, we really get to give the viewers kind of a peek into our reasoning and our thinking, and they get to see us agree but also disagree and articulate our positions and kind of explain what goes on in a judge's head and get really behind the scenes. Well, it's terrific. It really you know, it educates not only the litigants but everyone who's watching about what to watch out for. So thank you so much for joining us. I can't wait to see what happens this season. Thank, Thank you so you much, Cindy. Cindy. And once again, the 10th season of Hot Bench premieres on Monday, September 11th. You can watch it on CBS 2 at 4 and 4.30 p.m. It's going to be fun. 10th season. I know. Kind of second time back on. It's great because you make a great point. It's like a little junior legal education. Yep. You know what's going to work and what's not going to work.